Today, we can say the word finish. We complete the assembling of the NSU prints. I would like to thank you very much for watching because in the last videos I've seen a certain interest and uh, this makes me very happy. Uh, why don't you subscribe? This is a question. But anyhow, I'm very happy. Today we paint, we apply stickers. Then I want to try to do something for fenders, exhauster, and uh, mount the body properly. At certain point I wanted to have lights too, but uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't have light bucket. Uh, I can do them, uh, but this time I think that I will finish the car in this way. Then we have a test. Let's go to the work. Maybe I found a new way to build my fenders. Two materials, aluminium or aluminum, and uh, this is uh, the gummy for a tire tube. Tube tire, tire tube. Well, I, I know that this aluminium can flex uh, and uh, be folded by crashes. But uh, in uh, this position, I don't think this is useful to give the form to this. I will glue this over this. Then uh, with a double sided tape, you put here inside like that. It's not easy to show you. And this is for the rear. It's very easy because uh, the interior arrives about here. So I have space to attach. Front uh, is a different thing. So I have to do something modified. But the concept will be this. Let's see what does it comes out. done this is the rear now it has to be mounted properly now it's just put it down and uh, this is how now it's it's not perfect it has to be finished and this is this is the way to do fenders, inner fenders, rear, front, we will see. But they works very well. The car looks like a real one. Perfect. Let's do the front one. These are my fenders, very strange to see, very, how can I say, homemade, but I think they are quite functional, you see, it's a sort of motorcycle thing, so they are funny, they are not nice to see but when they are under the body you don't see them but uh, you won't see the the emptiness of the rc bodies about uh, well here yes Mm -hmm. 
under the car is quite closed I like this way there's a thing they work pretty well and uh, you can adjust it very easily just curving this you can do this this and this so you can give the right shape to follow the in inside profile of, of the of the species of the body and also this is made now we have to do exhaust I was telling you exhaust exhaust is quite far from here hmm. it's nice to see the exhaust let's find a picture to have inspiration And here it is, the exhaust. This is to attach to the engine, to the engine bay. But now uh, we have this thing. You see, this car has the bonnet opened. And if it is open, you have to see it open not with just a black part here that is quite difficult to mask uh, and here it doesn't give the, the, the right sensation. So I have decided to paint everything then open this part but if I open this through these holes I see the ground and nothing inside. It would be nice to put something and found uh, two very nice images of this car. And they are this one in which you see the exhaust system, quite difficult to, uh, to do, not impossible, but quite difficult. And uh, another image, uh, you can see the the engine uh, with uh, the carburetors uh, and the trumpets uh, for air intake uh, and perhaps I will do something like that very uh, uh, very few th things uh, the trumpets the carburetors uh, the tubes uh, the engine but just a square engine just a, a piece of something to fill up uh, this engine bay and so the work extend itself to other horizons and uh, this is nice this is what I like of this hobby let's start to see how to do the engine And as I told you, I just wanted to do a very simple engine, but uh, here in Italy, we used to say that one cherry brings to the other. So it means that uh, one thing takes to the other, then the other, the other, the other, until you have uh, too much. And this work uh, is like that, because uh, it's nice to have this kind of exhaust but the problem is is to get these four that are very big into this that it's not so big so now I have to reduce them then I have to do carburetors there are two carburetors double carburetors and then I want I want to do the the trumpets how do you call the the 
those tubes uh, like a trumpet. Then these are the, the candle uh, wiring. Then I have to do the distribution carter. Then here I want a sort of friction. Then we are quite finished. Uh, perhaps the distributor here for, uh, for the current. Then we have to think how to put inside the car. Perhaps I will take away this piece. This piece. This one. That one. And I make a motor mount. But I'm very happy of the, the shape of, of the case of the motor is just to support all the parts. But once installed, uh, you don't notice it. That is so old. Uh, it looks a uh, Ford Model T engine. Okay. Now I have to concentrate on that. That is not so easy. Wow, look here! We have the engine in the car and uh, this is just to justify the exhaust. I love it. Obviously you can do better, but this is quite enough. Here it is, the engine. And Next step, lights. My light buckets for the prints perhaps is a little bit ambitious. I would like to obtain the pieces from this aluminium, very big aluminium piece. Why? because I can polish the inside of the bucket very well, like chrome. I started with this tool, but it's too difficult. I decided for this. <laughs> It works. Comment, like, and subscribe. It's very hot.
And these are the lights. This is the switch controlled from the radio. I've made the supports, the bucklets and the supports for the LED. If you want to see my cheap and easy way to realize lights for your car, I give you the link in the description. And now we have to connect the switch. This is the switch I bought on uh, Banggood and uh, it's very cheap, $8 about. And I have to connect this to this and I connect directly without the plug. Then this to this, to the radio. And this wire is pretty long. If I want, I can short it. And this goes to the other parts of the electric wiring. So, so, so. Okay, I cut this wire. I take off this. Let's do the work. This is a tremendous shiso. Fantastic. Japan. Top quality. Okay, then this has to connect to the battery. And a piece of, of, what is it? Oh, I think I can use this one. Okay. Then we have to, is it hot? Not enough. I show you. It's very important when you have uh, to do this work, uh, first to put a little bit here, otherwise it doesn't work. Okay, and now I have to be Udini. Short wires are wonderful, but quite difficult to handle. Okay, then. And this. Done. You see, I have made my radio plug in this way. So you plug one by one. These are protected. So you start from the far position. Channel three. One. Two. Don't like it. 
Perhaps it has to go here. Ba -da -da -ba 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 -ba. Now we check this. And uh, do they work? Oh yes! And uh, my front lights are pretty good. Using aluminium, using plastic. Now I stop here this work. I go to the body. Masking, painting, then I install everything. And for today, this is all. Comment, like, and subscribe. And uh, bye bye.